All right, let's check out Valheim. You didn't know Verizon did home internet? Yeah, uh, Verizon Fios is what I've been using for uh, since I've been streaming full time. Uh, but now we've got Verizon Fios gigabit. Yeah. All right. Start game. Select character. But I have no characters. Is it supposed to be like pixely? Just want to make sure I don't have it set wrong. It's not widespread. You work for them and can't get it where I live? Oh, Stouffer, that stinks. Okay. It's pixelated. Okay. Alright. So you can make male or female characters. Skin tones. <laughs> wow, that one is so bright, it reflects. Hair, no hair. By the way, this game's in early access, just so you guys know. It just came out a couple days ago. Oh, we definitely want a beard. What kind of beard do we get? Oh. That's pretty good. Long? Long one, long two, short one, short two, short three, thick one. That's the end. You end with thick one. Hmm. Oh, I'm, th I'm thinking long. Do we want a ponytail? What's pony? What's this one? Oh, I don't like that one. Short? No. <laughs> Side swept. <laughs> it's good for your. Uh, it's good for your aim to have one eye completely covered. Side swept three. All right. Well. Long one. Long hair. I'm gonna just go with ponytail guy. Okay. Hair tone. Blondness. Blondness? I can't tell if, like, what color it is because of the fire. At least there isn't a man bun yet. There you go. I can't tell. Alright, so we'll be darker haired. There we go. Do we get randomly generated penis sizes too? No, this isn't flap floppy penis warrior. AKA. What's that? Conan. Why is it? I, I think I'm Rise of Conan. It's not Rise of Conan, was it? What was that game called? Bog. Conan Exiles. Thank you. I am Bog. I will start. New world. Otterville. Otterville. Is that a good seed? Start server. What is start server? Start. Could have been Otterman Empire. I could have been, but it wasn't. We're down in Otterville. Down at Otterville. Could have been Fraggle Rock. We should have made it Fraggle Rock. Now I want to start over. Wasting it away again in Otterville. Hey, Alex. This is a survival crafting game sent, set in a Viking-inspired world. The game almost crashed at you at this point. I don't know if it's common, but be warned. Okay, thank you. Now I'm anticipating crashing. Long ago... The Allfather Odin united the worlds. He threw down his foes and cast them into the tenth world, then split the bows that had their, held their prison, bows even, to the world tree and left it to drift unanchored, a place of exile. 
For centuries, this world slumbered uneasily, but it did not die. As glacial ages passed, kingdoms rose and fell out of sight of the gods. When Odin heard his enemies were growing once again in strength, he looked to Midgard and sent his Valkyries to scour the battlefields for the greatest of the warriors, dead to the world, they'd be born again in Valheim. Oh my goodness. I did not expect to start like this. So are we dead and we're being born again in Valheim? That's what I just heard? Is this sponsored? It isn't. No. I decided to play a crafting game. I know. I know. It's weird. Don't get used to it. Hey, I'm surprised sometimes. I'm surprised by what I like sometimes. Okay. Thanks. Hey, warrior. <laughs> Welcome to the tenth world, warrior. I am Hoogan. Sent here to guide you in your travels. The megaliths surrounding you are sacrificial stones. They represent the forsaken, which you must slay in order to ascend to Valhalla. Oh. Is that all I have to do? Okay. Oh, here's another one. Hey, warrior! Just flew in from Norway. My arms are tired. I like that. This stone is a Vegsavir. These ma magical stones were scattered throughout the lands by Odin as signposts pointing towards the ritual grounds of the Forsaken. If inspected closer, this one will reveal the summoning place of Ekthir, your first prey. He is a mighty beast, so you need to properly arm yourself before even attempting to defeat him. Okay. Can we talk for a second? Huh? Can we talk for a second? We can talk for a second. I, uh... I don't have anybody else to share this with. But, uh... Look at the size of this potato I bought. <laughs> I didn't know where this was going. Can you unwrap this thing? Oh my god, I love you for buying this. <laughs> What the hell is that? It's bigger than my head. It's about the same size. Jesus. I saw it and I just, I, I just, I had to buy it. <laughs> you bought this just because you saw it? Yeah. That I, is a sizable potato. I bought it because it's huge. Like, yes. Have you ever seen a potato that big? I don't know. It's hurting my arm just to hold it out like this. All right. When we get to a thousand subs, we're gonna raffle this off and send it to you. <laughs> when we get to a thousand subs, he eats this raw. Raw. I will send it to you anywhere in the world. I'm very sorry for distracting, but I just I couldn't believe that is, a, is that's a big potato. What are you gonna do with that? Don't put it on your foot. It's about the size of my foot. Good. It's, um, it's a foot size. I don't know. I'm gonna I will make dinner it's with foot. it. Okay, gonna make dinner with it. I, I'm excited for dinner suddenly. <laughs> That is a good Hasselback potato. You're right. Okay. So register location of Ekthir. He's like really close. Okay. 56, ah! 56, 56, scared me. 56, 56. Resub! Thank you for the 56. That map isn't the scale. Oh, thank you, Sacrificials. Oh, here we go. Long ages passed. He wore a crown beneath a blood red sky. Now naught is left of all he was, but his spirit cannot die. I think they're talking about me. Black wings across the moon and sun. Down from the mountain, our mother comes. Her weeping tears will fall like rain. Her voice will call us home again. Wanderer, look to your feet, then tread upon our tomb. One thousand bones without their meat will drag you to your doom. Attach item. Missing item required. Okay, so I can't attach. First of the forest, king in the wood, lord over those who dwell at his feet. His roots will grow where cities once stood, their blood his wine, their flesh his meat.
His antlers are branches of iron. They crack the rocks and bring down mountains. His hooves are the sound of thunder. His voice, a howling gale. All right. And that's all the help you're going to give me, isn't it? So now what? Pick up that. I got stuff, guys. Sticks and stones. Now, now it's time to punch trees. Oh. My unarmed skill just went up by punching a rock. Okay. Give me that. Crafting at recipes. Beach. Can I punch trees? I do zero damage. Oh, okay. Now you craft. Oh no! What's this game? It's called Valheim. Oh, raspberries. Uh oh. About to fight you? Oh no, okay. I bring tidings! Wait, wait, wait. This guy does not bring tidings. Hey! Dude! I don't even know how to fight yet! What's wrong with you? How much health do I have? Oh, I can do a kick? Get out of here! I blocked that. Will you swing? My skill jump improved. Ugh! Yes! My first fight! What did I get? I got his brain. Resin. His brain was made out of resin. All right. You have found a snack. Consume it to improve. <laughs> I'm not eating his brain. Be aware that long before you will grow hungry again. So try to always have at least a couple of different meals ready. Okay. How do I eat it? You have not explained. Uh, how do I look at my inventory? Tab. Uh, I ate it. I right clicked it and I ate it. Crafting. Craft a hammer. I can build a campfire now. Oh, and I got a hammer. Okay. What's this? Just to get inside your inventory stat. Thank you. Thank you. It's not brains. It's just resin. All right. So we got to get more stuff. What else? What else are you going to tell me, Burb? I'm going to repair you. Most items must be crafted. However, due to your recent departure from Midgard, you will have to recall the true shape of objects. Just pick things up and it will all come back to you, I'm sure. My lesser brother, Moonin... Tells me once uh, one can fashion a stone axe out of wood and stone. Okay. Wood and stone. How do I unequip stuff? Like I want to have nothing in my hand. Yeah. R? Ah, okay, R. Thank you. Hail warrior. Uh-oh. I gotta get stuff. Give me more stuff. What is... Those bees? Those are bees or something! Ow, ow, ow. Ow, ow! What do they do? They poison me? All right, hold on. <laughs> let me let me talk to the burb. Lots of bees, Rylar. Bees. You have crafted a hammer. With this tool, you will raise mighty halls and towering fortifications. Start by building a workbench. This, in turn, will enable you to construct other things. Okay, but I I didn't get my axe yet.
You're going too fast, game. I can't I can't actually beat things with a hammer. I guess I just gotta find rocks that are just laying around. That. Okay. No, nope, I need more stone. One more stone. Yeah, you can't hit things with your hammer, but you can punch things with your fists of doom! Red Dragonian, does this game have PvP elements like Rust and Arc? Uh, I don't know much about this game. I just picked it up this you know yet last night and decided to play it today however from what i was looking at on the steam store page it looks like it's meant to be co-opable with a small group of people on a server up to like 10 people yeah but the servers are are small unlike something like you know rust there you go evil twin like says you can activate pvp but servers are small okay all right can i make the i can so i make me a stone axe Apologize. Yeah. I actually did. I completely forgot. I made you a cup of coffee and just didn't like fix it before I left. Oh. So it was, there was just this cold cup of coffee sitting there. Okay. Gotcha. Can I attack with this? I'm gonna die. That's just the way to die. They have not told me about the wasp tutorial. I have been poisoned. I understand that. Try using fire. Oh, that's way too smart. How do I use fire? And now I got this guy. You can't eat more raspberries. What do you mean? Of course I can eat more raspberries. All right, get out of here, Gargamel. Grayling. Where are you going? What are you doing? Give me your brain. Okay. Maybe they're fire bees. Improved run! I'm just gonna go in and take the treasure and then get out. That's probably what I should be doing. How do I take all? Take all. Alright, go, 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 go. Alright, what do we get? I'm almost dead. I am almost dead. The bees attacked me first, Pinky Fluff. Okay. All right, so now what do we get? We got coins, feathers, amber. Sweet. Okay, we've made a stone axe, crude axe for fel tree felling, a crude but useful weapon. Can a stone axe be used for a weapon too? Active effects. Oh, here's my skills. Trophies. I have none. P oh, PvP! No PvP. Okay. Oh, yeah. Subliminal Snail. That movie's awful. What a terrible movie. You used an axe at first to fight with? Yeah, I wonder if I... Is this is an axe, right? I I'm having trouble... Yeah, it looks like a hammer, but it's actually an axe. Okay. So I have to build a campfire, they said. Even twinling, does it matter where I make it? I highly suggest finding a flat location. Okay. Nice and flat.
Added wood. Stones. Nice. Lambo, thanks for following. I don't know what I, if I'm getting anything out of this. There we go. Some wood. Oh, there's boars. Added raspberries. Whoa, 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 chill. Nice. Okay. Resin. Alright, let's try to kill a boar. Yes! That was a blow! No, you don't. Yo, they're gooey. I keep are these like what are these wisps? I keep thinking somebody's shooting arrows at me. Oh, it's a deer. Bear! Ah, oh, come back. Ah. Oh. It's on the ground here. Those mushrooms. These deer are gonna lead me to something I can't beat. So let's uh. It's the wind. It's the colors of the wind. So I can paint like the colors of the wind. You know, I think I own whatever land I land on. You know, as if the dead thing. Whoop. Like the earth was just a dead thing. That you can claim. But now I know that every rock and tree and creature. Has a life. Has a spirit. Has a name. Beach! I have no stamina left. Come back and let me pummel you, right? I know. Alright, so I'm not finding anything flat. You're surprised that I know that much of the lyrics? How can you be surprised by that? I'm a Disney freak. Does it have to be flat or flattish? I don't know. I would assume flattish is okay. All right, what about like right here? Right, right by the Stonehenge thing. Whoa, that goes way down. Let's make it here. Let me get rid of that. It's too hard. Okay. For some reason, I always felt like Pocahontas was downplayed. Poca I saw Pocahontas in the theater. I don't think it's the best of the Disney movies by far. Um, But I have watched it a bunch. All right, let's, let's try to do it right here. How, did they tell me how to make a campfire? Uh. The music was great. And I love the the old mother willow or whatever, the, the, the grandmother tree or whatever. The, that one. You will understand. Aha. Craft. No, 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 craft that. I already crafted that once. Okay, now I got another one. Equip my hammer. My hammer is equipped. Aha. Cooking station, workbench. Campfire. See, now I'm feeling like this isn't the best place. Nice meat, Azaria. All right. You 
you just received Artesian's monthly newsletter. They're giving away a 2.5k computer. Go for it, Otters. Oh my god, look at that link. Alright, go gang. That's Artesian. I actually had... I forgot I had a... Um, an Aver Media thing I needed to get ready for today. We have a giveaway... That our community is going to be a part of. But our community has to have the most entries out of the Aver Media partners... In order for one of us to win. Or one of you to win. So let me make a note of that. We'll get that set up for tomorrow. All right. I feel cold. When the temperature drops at night, or if you're wet, you will suffer from being cold. This reduces your stamina regen. Seeking shelter by an open flame is your best option when this happens. Subtle hint to get going on that campfire, isn't it? All right, I'm going back over here by... Stonehenge. And I'm going to make my base. Okay. Right about here. I am getting warmer. Literally. All right. So what else could I make? What else? What are those noises? I saw that guy just run past me. Better get out of here. You know what's good for you. Yeah, you better run. You coming back? How am I gonna get your brain all the way down there? I'm not going. I'm not gonna want to fall down there. Fog burns down a forest. Film at eleven. So what else can we make? What is that? Wood stack, stone pile, cooking station, workbench. Thirty-five is a big number. Except if you're talking about cookies, then it's not enough. That was gigantic. Tangerine Cupcake, thank you so much for the 35 months. Hello. The workbench allows you to craft complex items as well as giving you access to lots more building pieces to construct with the hammer. I can see that. Hey, Hollow Jack, what's going on? Crafting station needs a roof. I need a cooking station. Can I put that over the fire? Yes. There we go. Alright, now look at this. Oh my god, we got floors. See, this is where my head starts to spin. Floors, walls, doors, gates, stairs, ladders, thatch roof. One thing I have heard about this game is when you're building like a house, you actually have to have proper ventilation in the house. Otherwise, the smoke fills up your house and you... Yeah. This part tripped you up. They want you to build the crafting bench first, but it needs a roof, which needs the crafting station built. LOL. Okay, that is weird. But I, I feel like I need to have much more mats in order to do anything, right? We're gonna need more stuff. And I can't... Oh, I can chop this. Okay. Timber! Getting very tired. I got beach seeds. 
Log. Another day in paradise? I hear ya. Hi, Regal Peach. Did I just chop down the whole forest? That's the most Viking way I've ever seen about chopping down trees. We'll have this whole forest chopped down. Right quick. Too hard. Too hard. How much wood did I get? 20 wood there. It's too hard. Let me guess I'm going to need stone. Really going to need a bed. All right, well, I've got some wood. So now I have to, what kind of roof do I have to put on this evil twin link? Crafting station needs a roof. So I have to build walls, I would assume first. Okay. I have no idea how this works. Okay, so the mouse wheel spins this around. A mystical force in this area stops you. I hate when that happens. Like that's too, too far? Is it cause I'm too close to this? I'm too close to this starting spot. I think. Oh, I duffed that up. Okay. You went decently far away. Well, I didn't see anything that was flat. Ah, eh, we'll hope it's okay. I just lit myself on fire. Oh, I don't want to die! I don't want to die! Okay, I got five health. It's fine. Guys, if you're ever in a situation like I was just in, just hop around crazily. It's fine. What can I cook? Cook. What am I cooking? Did you... Oh, they put my meat on there. Okay. Yeah, Malice, I light myself on fire. The game is like, you feel cold. All right, do I have to take the item out? How do you... Cooked meat. Okay. I'm going to eat it. Board trophy. This would make for a nice decoration in any house. Okay, so I ate it. Is that giving my health back? Heavens to Betsy! A 13 month I slept myself on fire again. Event. This time we're gonna Exit. die. Stage left! Meta! Bo got her hype, Bo got her hype, Bo got her hype, Bo got her hype. Hi, Meta! I need to build, like, a safety perimeter around my fire. Stop, drop, and roll. Is there a way to do that? I don't know how to do that. Day two. It's the dawning of a new day. I've only lit myself on fire twice.
Okay, maybe I have to do a floor in order to get this to rise up. Oh, see, look, there's a problem here. There we go. Heavens to Betsy! A 13 month resub event! Exit! Stage left! Well, there we go! Meta just gifted a sub! As well! Thank you so much, Meta! How are you doing? Gang, we've had seven new or gifted subs today. Three more, we'll do another game all giveaway. We're trying to get to 600 sub points to unlock a Scream Stream, so I'll play the medium. Which is a horror game that just recently came out. So thank you so much to uh, Meta for helping us get there. All right. So here we go. I hope... I have no idea how much wood I have. Missing requirement. All right, now we don't have any more wood. Okay. It's time... Find some more wood from all the trees we knocked down. You've already learned new stuff? You did the floor first, and that was much more difficult. You usually build the floor first in these kind of games. Yeah, don't do that. Just go right for the walls, I guess. I don't know if this is the best way to get wood. Yeah, no, I agree, Elden. The fact that there's, like, a mystical element to this. Like, I know there's boss fights. I know there's boss fights. Um. And mystical things in this. Obviously, we're, we're dead, right? I just chopped the tree down on top of myself. Yes. Each time you're struck down, you will forget a small part of your abilities and drop your belongings at the site of the accident. If you were uh, home by now, I'd recommend building a bed wherever that home may be. Okay. Hey, Meneer. Here's me. Okay, items recovered. Great, sweet. Is there a way so that Is there a screen shake? Camera shake. That's much better. That's much better. Did that hurt me? This game is from the Demo Festival on Steam? Uh, I don't think so. I, I, I bought it. it. It came out in early access a couple days ago. It was 20 bucks. You can type hashtag game to take a look. Hi, Sar. I'm doing all right, Meta. I'm doing all right. I'm playing uh, a game that I've heard, like, really good things about, but... Crafting and building games aren't usually my cup of tea, so we're gonna we're gonna see what we think together today. This must be weird. What's the what's the last game like this that I played? I'm trying to remember. Satisfactory? And I don't even know if that and that's not exactly the same. Cryofall, you're right, that's what it is. Cryofall. Yep. Wow. That is very... Very violent, the way you chop down trees in this. Alright, we're at 41 wood.
Can you sing the I'm a Lumberjack song every time you cut down the trees? I could. Alright. Are you gonna let me put, like, a wall over here? Like, what are you gonna let me do, game? Like, literally there is okay. So there is okay? I think I put my camp in the wrong place, gang. If you destroy... So this takes two wood to build a wall, right? Let me see what happens. Do I get two wood if we destroy one? Look at this wiggler. You running through my camp. You do get two back? Okay. I just one shot that guy. I'm gonna need a new, uh. Oh. Hey, Texoon, what's up? So I get all my mats back? I think we're gonna just go somewhere else. I don't wanna constantly have that issue. Take up my toys and I'm going home. Um. I can build furniture. How do I build just the normal? Here we go. I'm gonna need another. Let's get a club. I'll craft a club so I can hurt monsters. Probably better to repair. But, whatever. Alright, let's find a new home. Was there crafting like this in Outward? Not really. No. That's definitely more of an RPG. Sorry, says I was in the private alpha. You got all your mats back there. I didn't even look to see if it's changed in this version, but I'm pretty sure you didn't from what I've been hearing. Okay. Well, either way. Oh, what's this? It is a gift. A gift to the friends of the otters. The meta? Thank you so much for gifting three more subs. 23 gifted subs on the channel for meta now. Thank you, and congrats to uh, Hellbop and Shiveria and Chryselectrum on the subs. That's going to trigger another Game Vault giveaway. Meta, thank you so much for being so generous. And uh, whenever the mods are ready, let's do another Game Vault giveaway, please. Our third of the day. All right, let's see what this says. Thank you, Piggy Fluff. One clam to enter max of 500. Remember, you can only win one game from the vault a day. So save your clams if you've already won. And you can type exclamation point vault or click the link that somebody put in chat to see what's up for grabs. All right, heed these words of oof. A poor settler in a strange land. You will find here good stone and wood, all you need to build a house. You will need a craft a roof to keep out the rain, then you'll need walls to stop the roof from falling down. Finally, you must have a door, it will be much harder to go in and out. These things Ulf has learned for himself, now he writes them on this stone to help others. Pray to Odin for his soul. All right, Ulf, thank you. I've known an Ulf in real life. Anybody else know an Ulf? Skill with clubs. Oof is a really nice guy. I know. Good old Oof. Yeah, and outward you had cooking and potion making. That's right, Vulture. By the way, this is all procedurally generated. So, if you log in and you're playing on a server, your server is going to look different. is pretty cool. I wonder if uh, Evil Twin Link's uh, world had that drop-off like mine did. Added wood. Alright. I hear like a wolf. What do we think... What do we think about here? 
You mean the crow dropping you off or the... No, that cliff near my spawn point. Do you have... Did you have that drastic drop? Oh, this looks nice. It's so foggy. Wolf is a pretty normal name over here. I think I know three of them. One was my next door neighbor growing up. Yeah, in Sweden, I, I would bet. The Ulf I knew um, was Norwegian. And um, yeah, because I um, my aunt used to be married to Uncle Pear from Norway. So we had a lot of uh, Norwegian culture and we met folks from Norway all the time when I was growing up. All right, um, this looks good. It's a little hilly. It's not as flat as I want it to be. Maybe here? What do you guys think? Burkina, thanks for following. Oh, you didn't have that drop off. You spawned near a lake. Okay, interesting. Well, before I start building, Evil Twin Lake, what do you think based on your game time yesterday? Does this look pretty good? I mean, it's hilly though. It's not flat, but this area looks pretty good. You get a tool to flatten? Okay, eventually, probably. All right, let's 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 settle here. Don't you need food too? Yeah, I guess. Um, yeah, what, how, how do I see my statuses again? Active effects. No skill drain. If you die, you won't lose any. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming I am hungry, though. There, I ate a raspberry. Okay. Okay, one minute left in the raffle. One clam to enter, max of 500. Get in there. Why do this Norway have barcodes on the sides of their warships? So when they return, they can scan the Navy in. I like it. Try again, Leo Wild. All right, campfire. Campfire. Okay. Cooking station. Workbench. Building. I'm not gonna make, I'm not gonna make it too ginormous. But I definitely don't want to build, like, a tiny shack and then have to, like, immediately expand it later. Okay, that's a gap. Well, that's gonna be interesting. If it doesn't snap, is it okay? Like, is that okay? McSwirlton, congratulations on winning the raffle. Send me a message. This is where hills make things tricky. True. Oops. You know, it seems pretty easy to to build and like break stuff, though. Again, if the snapping is not important, I can just kind of like eyeball it. Like I don't know. I'm about to step on the fire again. I have to build a door. Don't forget the door bog. You can level off the ground with a hoe if you want to make the height even. Do I have the ability to make a hoe? 
Is that inside out for the walls? Yes! But I wanted the nice side to be inside so I could see it while I'm in there. Does that work? <laughs> I can't believe I built the whole thing the wrong way. If I get the small section of roof over the workbench. All right. Oh, hold on. I want to... See, now I'm going to mix it up and it's going to look like ass. Hi. Get out of here. What is your problem? All right. You know what? This is just how it's going to be. I hear more monsters. Get out of here! What is wrong with you? Get lost. Your video paused and it looks like Bog is sleeping sitting up. It's never happened before. What do I what do I get for that? Leather scraps. Ah, okay. All right, so how do I build a roof? Thatch corner. Okay, does that count as a roof? Last call, McSwarlton. You want a game ball giveaway? Roll your face over the keyboard before you lose. Out on it. Oh, are you kidding me? Graylings. There you go, McSwarlton. All right, send me a message on Discord. And let me know uh, what games you want. I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't even know how to use that piece. Thatch corner. That's me in the corner. <laughs> I, my, 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 uh, my building will never look nice. I can tell you that now. Okay, so does that technically count as a roof over <laughs> the workbench? How do you tell if it counts? As long as it functions as a home, I guess it works. I put a roof over it. Try to use it with E. Station is too exposed. How enclosed do I have to make it? Don't step in the fire. Ah, oh, that was a terrible one. What about now? Are you still exposed? Hey, we did it!
Okay. Upgrade. Uh. Ho. Craft ho. Oh! New building piece. Level ground. Hello. Get lost! I can't wait till I'm tough enough to go explore and... Pick dandelions. I can't wait for the part where I get to pick dandelions. Ho, ho, ho. Green giant. Exactly. Level ground. Level it. I feel cold, but look, I'm right here. Oh god, the creepy crow's back. What if I level stuff that's already, like, in here? Is that okay? Alright, what do you need? This tool is used for landscaping. You could say it's the perfect complement to the hammer. Use it to clear the ground and manipulate the terrain. It's easy to create buildings on level ground. Okay. You built a house and leveled the ground under it because the grass was going through the floor. Well, I'm glad that they let you do it retroactively. Why is my fire out? I need stone. Bend the lines. More dandelions. I'm gonna die. Out in the wilderness looking for rocks. So. Can I hammer a rock? No. Hey, Naka, what's going on? You could eat another bite. Yeah, I haven't really found much in the way of food, have I? This rock is hammered. I guess I need like a pick. Could I make a peek? I'm finding wood. I thought ber okay, berries is good. Very good. Delish. More. More. Guys, I don't even know where my... How do you find your house again? Can you mark places on the map? How do you find your house? You can mark places on the map? How okay. Wait, 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 but I don't know where my house is. I think it's over here. Everyone remember where we parked the house. There it is. All right, so how do you mark on the map? Because that needs to be done now. Oh, here we go. House. Good. That's a good feature. All right. I can craft a bed. There we go. Get out of my bed! Sleep the night away in your bed and awaken feeling refreshed and full of energy. Another improvement to your home would be chests where you can store items. It's a good practice to always have some spare equipment if something unfortunate should happen to you while exploring. Okay. Got it. Hi, Bleeding Fish. What's going on? 
Extra life gen. Thanks for following. Unclaimed bed. Bed needs a roof. I gave you a roof. All right. I know I need, still need a rock. I don't know how this works. Okay, hopefully that gives me all my mats back, right? How does it grow? How can I make it go taller? Do I need to like... Oh, it's so finicky. Like that? How's that? This is gonna be the jankiest house ever. And I'm all about it. There we go. Does that count? That needs a roof. I gave you a roof. Yeah. Uh, Extra Life Gen says, you have the most incredible emotes and I came because of them. I just hit affiliate my first mode of Putin. I think you'll approve as well. Oh, nice. Otters. Congratulations. That's awesome. Did they, uh, did the bed say that when you sleep, you will wake up refreshed? Can you tell me where you bought this magic bed? I know, right? <laughs> you should have two different angles of roof, a tall and a short. Um, thatch roof 45. Oh, the 26 one? Oh. I see. And now I don't have enough stuff. All right, now we definitely need to find woods and wood and stone. Bog makes a giant tall slope and calls it a roof. It worked for the workbench. The workbench, uh, we needed to build a roof over. Don't fall on my house. Be sure to sit uphill at your table in case you spill your coffee on your cat. That hasn't happened since this morning. We haven't spilled any coffee on a cat since this morning. Okay, so how, how do you get rocks, gang? <laughs> like, besides just finding them? <laughs> Can you club stone? It doesn't seem to do anything. does zero. You can make a pick. Not without stone. <laughs> you're looking this game up on Steam. You discover the game publisher is Coffee Stain Publishing. And you're right. It is. How funny is that? And I spilled my coffee today. Right before we played it. Hey, there's a stone. I found a stone. Oh, my God. One stone. Is that all I need? Oh my god, look at this. Literal gold mine. Alright, here we go. 
Uh, that is too exposed. We'll work on that. I can't make a. I can't make a. A pick. Rag tunic. Upgrade rag tunic quality to two. Oh, those are upgrades. Oh. That's the sound it makes when you hit 20 months of subbing. Thanks. Milkrin! Pushes a button. Thank you so much for the 20 months. How you doing? Thank you. All right, I need help. Give me some help, gang. How do I, how do I farm rocks? It is a gift. A gift to the friends of the otters. Thorny Subject, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Extra Life Gen. I appreciate that. That's our 11th newer gifted sub of the day. Four more, we'll do another Game Ball giveaway. Stone Axe. A Crude Axe for Tree Felling. There are lots of racks out and about. If you want or you can just pick them off the ground. All right, I'll try that. Irish Dalek. Thanks for following. There's... Wait, but come back. I'm nice. Wait, come back. I'm super hungry. I mean, I'm nice. I'm very hungry and nice. Rocks go back where I was. Fi I was finding uh, deer. You just looked up how to get the pickaxe. Was not what you expected. How did you? Um, how did you survive the early game then, with your rocks? All right, I have to change the order of this stuff. It's driving me absolutely bonkers. Alright, let's have that there. If I need a torch, I can always hit a torch. You were near a river. Would you stop? To if you talk about that river one more time. I didn't get a river. I got a steep cliff. I can eat another bite. Um, <laughs> All right, here we go. Look at this raspberry land. I think we have enough rocks now for a little bit. Ooh. Stay right there. You're fine. Stay right there. Oh no, that's a hoe. Don't don't attack with the hoe. Come back. I just want to taste you. Man. I probably could catch it if I had something to eat other than raspberries for the past nine days. Is this an all-tabable game? It is. Okay, sweet. One second. 